What is up guys, it's Dr. Sammy. And Dr. Ashley. And today we're gonna talk about what to expect during your child's first dental visit. Taking your child to the dental office, especially for the first time, can be stressful if you don't know what to expect. We hope this video will help relieve some of that first visit anxiety. So let's jump right in. The AAPD recommends that your child visit the dentist at age one or first sign of tooth eruption, whichever comes first. The dentist will typically take x-rays and the amount of radiographs taken depends on his or her age. Now you may be wondering, are x-rays really needed? Well, a lot of cavities are hidden in between the teeth and require x-rays to be seen. Additionally, radiographs allows your dentist to see if your child's adult teeth are properly developing or if there are any potential concerns. Many parents also ask, are they safe? The short answer is yes. There are multiple steps and factors that are employed to ensure patient safety. The amount of radiation used to take two to four radiographs exposes patients to about 0.005 units of radiation. In fact, you receive more radiation from just flying on an airplane for several hours. If radiographs are not completed and we wait until the cavities are larger or start to cause pain, additional more invasive dental treatment may be required. It is also difficult for your dentist to give an accurate oral diagnosis without radiographs. The dentist will also complete a clinical exam, meaning he or she will look inside the child's mouth. This will allow the dentist to examine for any cavities, broken teeth, teeth, infections, or crowding. After the exam, a child cleaning is performed with either a rubber profi cup or a hand scaler. The rubber profi cup is soft and used to remove plaque. It can even give the child a slight tickling sensation. The scalers are hard and used to remove calculus. I know this looks scary, but your dentist will use a variety of techniques to describe instruments and procedures in a child-friendly way. Okay, Timmy, we're gonna use Mr. Whistle to clean out the sugar bugs, but first, I wanna put your tooth to sleep. Finally, the dentist will apply fluoride to the teeth, which helps protect your kid from future cavities. The topics of both fluoride and behavior management are huge topics that we want to fully cover in upcoming videos. We hope you enjoyed the video, and if you have any questions, please leave it down in the comment section below. We will be posting a series of videos regarding pediatric dental care, so if you want to see more videos, please subscribe and like. Have a good day. I don't think I'm doing it right. What's, what's the other one we could do? What's the Fortnite one?